Hey guys, I just want to do a, a better video on my uh, on my uh, Tech XL because uh, the other one, the, you know, the video size is a little small and uh, you guys couldn't see as good as uh, you wanted to see, you know. Um, you know, this bag is a really good bag. Um, I love everything about it, but it just gets a little heavy, like I said before. Um, this side of the bag, we have this little pocket here. We have another pocket right here that I keep my uh, little notepads and, uh, you know, uh, the 516 uh, adapters for the mini splits. Sometimes I work on those. I don't like to work on them, but I do. <laughs> I'd rather stay on, uh, on chillers and cooling towers and uh, big package units, but... Sometimes I have no choice. So on this side of the bag, I got, first of all, this button right here, how they do it in the videos and they snap it so easily, it's not possible. It always, it takes time. It takes about two minutes for me to do it, so I never really do that. And then uh, the strap never seems to stay in place. It always falls off and gets underneath the bag and uh, you know uh, tilts the bag over. Um, right here I have my uh, Knipex um, pliers wrench, uh, I've got the 10 inch, uh, these act, they're sort of like uh, adjustables, but uh, they're a lot better, um, they're a little pricey as you can see, I, I take, I use these to take off uh, Trainers and stuff like that. Uh, instead of bringing out the the, the uh, pipe wrenches, so those are really really handy. They're really good. They've helped me out a lot. Okay, then I got here the two Klein adjustable wrenches. I got the six and the eight. Uh, they're not actually made by Klein. They're made by uh, Erica. Company, uh, it's a German company, but they're manufactured in uh, Spain. Okay, right here I have my Klein strippers. They're all right. Here I have my uh, wheelhouse screwdrivers, insulated, number two Phillips, and a number one slotted, I believe. Okay, put that back right there. And I have my traditional nut drivers. Long shank right here. Quarter five sixteen three eighths. Okay, I'll put that back later. Uh, got my linesman pliers here. Beautiful linesman pliers. I love these a lot actually. Very good handles. Uh, this blue part is like a rubbery type of a coating, and then the other one is like a harder plastic. I have my diagonal cutters, Knipex. These are uh, very powerful, man. I mean, they can cut through almost anything, even piano wire. Here I have a small Klein um, needle nose. I think it's a six inch. Then I have uh, the longer one. I don't know what it is. Maybe that one is a five inch. This may be a. I think this is an 8 inch. Okay, here I have my uh, Knipex channel locks, groove lock pliers, whatever they call them. Behind that, I have my Klein Vert. This is actually made by uh, NWS Germany. If you can see, they're made in Germany. They made this for Klein. So, it's actually good. It's, uh, it ratchets up. I can't do it with one hand, but they're good. Here I have my uh, long 11 inch needle nose pliers for hard to reach areas. All right. And uh, now I got my crimpers here. Klein. There, right. Got my uh, Allen keys, uh, 
thermometer and uh, stubby, a couple of small screwdrivers. And I'm going to turn on the background the other side. Just hold on one second. So on this side, I got my uh, cold removers, removing tool. I have a yellow jacket and a CND. CND was 22 bucks. The yellow jacket was in the 40s. So I uh, got here. Uh, Speed wrenches. They're actually awesome. I love them. Got a mirror, stream light flashlight, rechargeable. Really good flashlight. A couple of client screwdrivers. And some more nut drivers, the bigger sizes. I have here um, my uh, laser gun, some markers, the Subco. This is the Subco Megometer. It's pretty good, it works well. And uh, how this works is that anything in the green is uh, insulation is good, anything in the yellow is uh, caution, and then red is totally bad. And uh, that's my bad, you know. Pretty good bag if you ask me, just a little heavy. Thanks for watching.